All right, make sure the first two items make sense. How we found the spaces for all four people to sleep at, the safety barrier, and now the ample storage. Um, I don't have mine fully storaged yet, but just enough to get you started. So here goes. Three says, now the client wants some sort of climbing system. Like a ladder, some steps uh, built into each end of the bed, allow access to the top bunk from either side. Requesting the steps of the climbing system be the exact same spacing apart. So consistent. Okay. Um, how tall should we go? We don't know. Take a ruler, head to your stairs in your house, measure them. Maybe use those for example. Okay, look at it. Here we go. So again, I don't have all my storage in, just enough from the last video, but you're going to add more to have it fully storaged. Mine's nowhere near that point yet. Okay, steps in the ends. Well, last when I stopped these short, I went back 12 inches. So I only have 12 inches of room here for my ladder system. All right. Um, I could build my ladder here. This is the end. Or here, this is the end. My choice. Or here, this is the end. But because I have my storage here, I'm limited to having a real small ladder. So I might have to have my ladder be on this end. Let's see how it goes. So I'm going to use the same kind of measuring I used for my last time. Uh, my cell phone was three inches wide. So I'm going to go in three inches. And I'm going to go in three inches. Where's my line? Get back on the green axis. There it is. And then I'm going to measure up for my stairs. Um, I'm going to use, uh, I'm going to go mine every 12 inches because that'd be 12 inches, one foot, two foot, three foot, four foot, five foot, six feet. That works. Um, if I go, no, I'll go eight inches. Eight work too. Okay, because eight is a multiple of six feet, right? Six times 12. Okay, that go into eight. Hope so. We'll find out. So I'm going to go each step. I'm going to go up eight inches. Eight enter. And now my step is going to be next one, eight more inches. And then eight more inches all the way up. Let's click move, eight, enter. Click move, eight, enter. So there's all my steps. This should be my, uh oh, did it work? Pretty close. That's fine. They're all the same. So now my step's going to land below it, okay? Um, what I'm going to do, so I think here if I start drawing here, I build one on the bottom here first. The bottom, I don't need a step. So this is the top of my stair. And my step be maybe an inch thick. Not very thick, but not very thin. So I'm going to build this little zone with the rectangle from that corner to that corner. I'm going to push this zone in. I have one foot of room, but I'm going to go, I'm going to go 11 inches. because I want a foot from the inside. I don't want to have that wall break through. So go in 11 inches. Okay. I measure again, this one down that one inch and draw that rectangle from there to there and push that one in how far? That's right. 11 inches. So I'll get the rest here. Be right back. Okay, so eight did work. Why didn't I put the shelf up here? The stair because, oopsie, get out of there. That is my little safety zone. So I can't put it in a safety zone for that. That's there. So you erase off all my lines. There is my one stair. So this side is, oopsie, get out of there. We need to go for that. Um. Uh, how I undo things is the back arrow or control Z. So I want control Z for that, right? Um, more keyboard shortcuts. I hit the letter O, it means orbit. See that? And roll the mouse up or down to zoom in, zoom out. L, watch here, means line. E means erase. O means orbit. Okay. So now I have that ladder in. Over here, I might build mine in this side, I'm thinking. So there's one ladder down, one ladder to go. Um, do you have to go eight inches? No. Do you have to go 11 inches in? No. But make them evenly spaced, make them look planned, all right? Um, if you want to build a little safety handle, that's an option too. 
Um, bad idea. Let's just draw a line. I know. Let's do that real quick here. I'm going to draw a line from there to there, all the way up. It's going to click, click, go those things in. And I'm going to show you what I'm going to do here. Little safety lines. We'll show you. Build those in. So what if it's, you know, um, some old, like uh, maybe a grandma or grandpa wants a top bunk for fun. Um, I can now grab this and pull this side out. Right? So wait, almost done. Get rid of these. Zoom, zoom. Get rid of those. So the wall is not any more safe to handle, is it? Nope. I'm going to take and just measure in a little bit, but speed things up. I'm just going to draw a rectangle up here. Um, why that filled in is because that line came in. I click on it. I push delete. You'll come back. No worries. Watch here. Get rid of, get rid of, click delete, click delete, click delete. Um, I have a three inch chunk here. Click push that in three inches. And now look. I have a little hole there for a handle. Now grandma can grab onto that railing and not be safe or not be not be safe not be unsafe one letter down one letter to go checkpoint three